In this episode, I'm featuring my top 5 list of the most amazing ships and watercraft concepts from Lazzarini Designs. It's a little different from my usual videos and just for a bit of fun. Stick around until the end to see my top pick. The Lazzarini Design Studio is never a stranger to headline-grabbing projects, from flying cars, powerboats, megayachts, and even floating homes. This company was founded by Pierpaolo Lazzarini, an Italian designer with highly artistic visualization and prototyping skills. Lazzarini spent years working in the automotive field, and is now a freelance designer who believes in a different design approach, which will be quite obvious in the projects I'll share in this video. His designs are well known globally, extending the design process from the automotive industry to the yachting world, creating something that architecture lovers and those interested in the unique and outrageous would definitely appreciate. I'm Ava and this is Harbour Masters, sharing with you news and information on the latest boats and the best luxury yachts. Starting at number 5 is the UFO 1.2. This watercraft is essentially a two-level structure that comes with batteries, wind turbines, and optional solar panels, which would make it endlessly autonomous. Storage space, living quarters, and the ability to move across short distances would make this the perfect place to stay, in a post-apocalypse-like scenario. Within, the upper habitable area would be a living room with a small kitchen and the captain's station, while the bottom one would consist of the living quarters and bathrooms. The massive window on the submerged room can be fitted with a similarly sized wiper that ensures the views of the seabed are never obstructed. This watercraft has an estimated base price of 20 million US dollars. At number 4 is the Zeno's Hyperyacht. This bullet-shaped concept was inspired by Bugatti, and aims to be the fastest superyacht in the world in its class. Made of aluminum and carbon fiber materials, its modern shape was designed for comfortable high-speed rides, and it is equipped with twin, triple, or quad engines, for a total of 7,300 to 15,000 horsepower. Zeno's is envisioned to reach a top speed of 90 knots, setting the record for the fastest yacht in its size. The energy company Architaly has integrated a solar power system into the roof, which will allow Zenos to operate in electric mode for up to 8 hours. The design combines futuristic performance with luxurious spaces. It features a deck lounge, a living room, three spacious suites, and a large lounge at the top. To the aft, Guests can store water toys, and use the adjustable bridge to allow a fabulous Bugatti to come in and out. This yacht has an estimated starting price of 39 million US dollars. Number 3 on my list is the Avangardia. Named after the English word vanguard, this is inspired by 1970s Japanese manga illustrations and features an extensible control tower that resembles the head of a swan. Its propulsion comes from twin fully electric side engines and an MTU Rolls-Royce jet engine with a top speed of 18 knots. The control tower or bridge used to operate the yacht is moved by an extensible crane. The head can even be completely detached from the yacht and used as a separate 16-meter boat. Furthermore, this ship has two jet capsules in the aft, five tenders, plus a separate head tender, and space for two helicopters on two hangars. This amazing ship can spread across five decks and can transport a total of 60 passengers. The estimated project cost is 500 million US dollars. Sailing at number 2 is the Prodigium. 
This superyacht was inspired by ancient Roman architecture. Prodigium features an upper deck made of carbon fiber and aluminum, specifically designed to resemble the shape of a shark. On the deck below, the upper structure is supported by two Roman columns on the sides of the main entrance. Other features include large solar panels covering the upper deck, and a hybrid propulsion system that can reach a cruising speed of 22 knots. It features three separate swimming pools behind each deck, with gorgeous waterfalls cascading from each pool to the one on the deck below. It also has a 34-meter beam providing vast indoor living areas, including the main living area on the upper deck. This superyacht is spread over six different decks and can carry a total of eight tenders stored in two garages and up to three helipads, each housed in its own hangar. The cost of this yacht is approximated at 600 million US dollars. Finally, number one on my list is the wire. The concept of this watercraft city called Wireland consists of a group of pyramid-shaped floating buildings called wire that are inspired by Mayan and Japanese architecture. This amazing ship is made of fiberglass, carbon and steel, and each level can be added in place once the base has been anchored on the seabed. Each large pyramid would have an engine and a propeller in the basement, so that the platform can be operated independently to move to a different position. Furthermore, these floating buildings would come in different sizes and serve different purposes, so that they can offer different living and entertainment settings, such as hotels, shops, spa, gym, bars, cinema, or for any purpose at all, ultimately creating the first floating city. The largest could rise to a maximum height of 30 meters or 98 feet above the waterline. The price of this watercraft is still undetermined, since the Wireland project is very much in the concept stage at present, but Lazzarini is hoping to raise the funds necessary to begin construction with a crowdfunding campaign. So, what do you think of Lazzarini designs? Are their watercraft concepts outlandish or possible? Share your thoughts in the comments section. If you enjoyed this list, don't forget to like and share the video to help support my channel. If it's your first time here, please subscribe and turn on all the notifications, so you won't miss any of my uploads. Thanks everyone and smooth sailing!